Hey everybody, I've shifted all my link shortening to Bitly. I'm going to show you why and how. So let's start off with one of my favorite websites, Kathy Schrock's Guide to Everything. And I'm going to copy the link up here at the top and we'll go into Bitly and we'll paste in the link here and it creates a link. Now you see this little pencil. I didn't know where this was. Shout out to reader Chris Perkle for showing me this trick when I shared a tutorial on tinyurl not too long ago. So I'm going to um, say shock assessment. Well let's do rock, shock rock, rubric. I want it to be shorter so I can remember it. And now I have this lovely link. Now you'll notice that I actually don't use the bitly you have the option to do j.mp which kind of stands for a jump and the reason is because it actually saves you even more letters uh, it also shows me other people that have used this link i click copy and now i can paste it anywhere i want to now the other advantage of doing it this way is that when you share it i've linked it with my twitter account with my buffer account uh, all the places that i share it actually tracks your clicks or such and um this is a, a link here and I can go to the link, but I can click here and say view stats. And that's so cool because I can see who's clicking on a link, who shared a link, um, where the links came from, um, and who's tweeting about it. Uh, just lots of other little tips and tricks.